Hello again, this is Jaybird Drone, and I'm out with the Mavic Air 2 today. I'm going to do a little bit of a range test, so enjoy. And uh, if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and hit all notifications, and I'll keep you informed with the latest and greatest new drones. Thank you. Let's make sure our settings are all good. Let's check everything. Max distance, nothing, no limit. Max altitude, keep it under 400 or keep it at 400. Auto return to home at 305. Okay, we'll do that when we're in the air. Got obstacle avoidance on. And then that auxiliary LED is the uh, light at the bottom. I'll keep that on auto. Use Imperial here in the United States. Okay, everything else looks good. Camera looks good. SD card we're using. Got it on all auto settings. Submissions, HD, channel mode on auto. Let's make sure everything looks good. Let's do a compass calibration since this is another new location for me. And I'm not guaranteeing a complete range test, but we will try to do a decent amount today. I'm still taking good care of this drone because it is brand new. So bear with me and stay tuned. And uh, each day I'll take it out a little bit further. I got the phone recorder on. And I will also do... The uh, SD card as well, and then upload that later on. Let's check it. 60 frames, 4K. Uh, let's see, everything else looks good. Is there different uh, settings on there? Let's go ahead and start our recording. Everything else looks good. Okay, we got that recording. Let's go ahead and uh, take her on up. It's kind of a sunny day, so bear with me. Okay, here we go. Let's go ahead and loop her around. Okay, bring the gimbal down. Enjoy this flight, everybody. Get some range today. At least try for two miles, maybe three if we're lucky. Uh, I'm not going to go too crazy, so enjoy. Okay, we're going up. Let's go ahead and flip her around. Okay, that looks good. Bring her up slightly. See how high we can get her here. There's plenty of room out here, which I like. It's a uh, local dog park. It's about 351. It's pretty good. Let's go ahead and uh, do full stick forward now. Let's bring it up 370. Why not? It should be okay. Okay, that's good. All right, here we go, folks. Just doing full stick forward. Let's, let me make sure our home point is good. Yeah, that's good. Should have checked that firsthand, but we're good. Just flying her over. Got it on normal mode. 86% on the battery. And if um, you all are just watching this video for the first time, 
and then follow the first two go ahead and charge your batteries individually for the first time one by one especially with the fly more combo do not and i repeat do not use the hub because you will have some issues with the battery becoming brick and you don't want that to happen so and here we go approaching half a mile still looking good fpv looks good 18 satellites 83 percent on the battery this battery was slightly drained because it was sitting we've had some rain but um that's good enough and we're just flying over this little um makeshift lake here it looks like so far we're doing good fighting a little bit of a breeze we're going to have rain the next three or four days i think so i wanted to get a, another flight out with this uh, before that happens just doing full stick forward Gimble up a little bit. For over a mile. Might try to do at least two, maybe three miles today. We're still good on signal. A nice day. Thank you all again for the nice words on the last two videos, the unboxing and the first flight in the United States. I appreciate you all. You are all like family. And um, go ahead and join the channel if you're new. And I'll keep you up to date on this drone as well as all the other new drones that are coming out. This is by far one of my favorite drones because I like the way the controller is set up. I like the phone on top instead of uh, the old style. It's definitely an improvement. And so we're out. It looks like we're out about two miles. Pretty close to two miles, I should say. really good let's keep going let's try to get out to those houses over on the center of the screen and then I'm going to fly her back because we are out pretty far we are we're at the two mile mark coming up still excellent uh, transmission I am um, using a normal mode. This is pretty good. So we're still doing good on that front. Still got excellent signal. I'm really good with that. It's well over two miles, folks. Let's go ahead and um, do a quick yaw around. And then I'm going to head back because that's pretty good for the second flight. I'm not going to take any chances. But so far you can tell the signal is still good. The FPV is good. Let's go ahead and fly her back. Sorry about that. Got that away from my screen. And fly her back this way a little bit. Still good on the battery at 68%. And uh, we 
just flying on and back. Definitely this thing does over two miles with no issues. And I do, uh, I will try another additional um, distance on the next video. Just wanted to give this a little bit more of a range test this time around. Yeah, I'm flying it back manually. But no breakup, strong signal on the FPV. So definitely does two miles without a problem. But I'll go ahead and do another flight here soon along the river where I can do even more range. But let's see, we're just coming back slowly. Bring the gimbal up a little, drop it down. It's real responsive out here. And she's just flying on back. Pretty good, folks. No issues at all with this quad. It's nice to see other people are starting to get this drone as well. I'd like to give a shout out to... Um, 400 AGL along with uh, Lloyd Menenhall. Uh, 400 AGL usually has a show on on Sunday nights. Head and check him out. And Lloyd Menenhall usually has his show on on Monday nights at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. He also does a nice show. And uh, vote for Lloyd for president. So we're just approaching the um, dog park that we're at. As you can tell, this this is doing really well. We're still at a mile. Nice even horizon. It's beautiful. Beautiful drone, folks. Not using any of the ND filters. I will try that out too on the next couple flights. This is still breaking it in for me. The ND filters don't look too hard to put on. I'll do a video on that too, on how to uh, put it on the uh, camera lens. And we're just flying safely over this field here. Let's do this. We're still good on the battery. No reason to rush back. Now, this was not a max range test. This was just to take it out a couple miles to uh, get an idea of how she does. But I am definitely liking this drone. I don't know what tripod mode does. So it's very low speed. So it goes about what's the max speed on tripod mode? It's like about eight, nine miles. God, that is slow. It also uh, slows down the uh, yaw on the uh, gimbal too. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Drop the gimbal back up. Let's put it back on normal mode. Might be doing a giveaway here soon to one of my lucky subscribers so just go ahead and hit the subscribe button hit all notifications and I'll keep you informed on that as well yeah we're just flying her on back folks just coming back still good on the battery we've been flying for about 13 minutes and we're still over 52 percent with recording so I imagine we'll get about 24, 25 minutes with recording on the battery. Yeah. Taking her easy on normal mode. Oh, 
hard to see the screen with this bright sunlight. But she's coming back towards us. Let's go ahead and bring her down just a little bit. There she is, folks. She's back to us. 